It's been awesome. I mean, we're carrying it over from last spring. I think we had a really defensive, solid defensive uh, season last spring and cut the errors to a minimum. And I think that the experience coming back is going to be huge for us. Last, last year, you came out of the gate really hot for this team. Have you changed your approach at all in the offseason now that other teams know you're one of the bigger hitters in this lineup? I think knowing that I'm not a freshman anymore and there's a sky report out there definitely helps. And knowing what other teams are going to do to me, attack my weaknesses, I sort of saw that last year in Big Ten season. So I think that's the biggest thing for me is just knowing how they're going to attack me. What's the biggest thing you want to improve going into this year? I would say swinging at pitches that I want to swing at. I feel like that's when I went at my best. And, you know, just staying within my zone, not pitching or not swinging at pitches that pitching coach wants me to swing at. So. What are your expectations for the upcoming weekend? We expect to go 4-0, get off to a really good start. We got a competitive group of guys out there. We're really excited to get kicked off. So we expect to come out of the gates hot and go 4-0 right away. Alex, what about on personal level for the season? Um, you know, there could have been a case made just for all Big Ten uh, freshman team last year, all Big Ten uh, caliber player. What, what about for yourself moving into your second season? I think the expectations have raised, the bar is raised. Uh, last year as a freshman, I didn't really come in with many expectations. But this year, having done a decent job last year, there's going to be a new role for me. And ultimately, we're expecting to play baseball in June and get into an NCAA regional. You know, personal success, that's great. But if the team succeeds and we're playing baseball in June, then that's the biggest thing. And on the defensive side of the ball, how helpful is it to have that entire infield coming back with the whole year of working with each other under your belt? It's awesome. I mean, Tad Scaly just left us for a job at the Blue Jays, and he was pivotal in getting us to where we were last season. But the coaching staff as a whole has done a great job of getting us ready, um, you know, really making his, his absence feel not as bad as it should. And the infielders have been working hard, and we're just an experienced group on the field that's looking to lead this team. Alex, speaking of an experienced group, you're only a sophomore, but you played a lot of baseball last year. Um, there's going to be a lot of guys this weekend that are, are stepping into bigger roles that haven't played as much, and there's going to be a lot uh, first years in the lineup. What, what, are you, what kind of advice would you give to those guys moving into uh, opening weekend? Those guys have been in the mix since the fall, so we've been giving them advice, and they've been really stepping into their shoes and doing well. Um, they've been getting a lot of reps in scrimmages, a lot of reps in the fall, and they've just been playing their own game. We just tell them that the game's not bigger than anybody. You've been playing this game since you were little, and you just got to focus on that. Kind of going off that, like off the field, what does the mentorship aspect look like? We're a really close-knit group of guys, and we had that same experience last year, and I think that was pretty essential in getting – us to the Big Ten Championship and playing the postseason. So we put really big emphasis on maintaining that relationship between everybody, whether it's a freshman pitcher or a sophomore infielder or senior infielder. It doesn't really matter. Everybody is really close, and that's going to be what's going to be key for us. How do the beginning of the season preparations work for you as a switch hitter? Do you have to do almost double the work from everyone else here? Yeah, um, usually in hitting groups, I'm in a guy. I'm in a group with uh, just me and another guy. Everybody is usually in groups of three, so I kind of got to take double hacks. Everybody thinks that it's just sort of you take half the reps, but in my eyes, I got to take double because it's two different swings, two different hitters. So, How excited are you to go down to Arizona playing an MLB spring training? Oh, it's going to be awesome. I mean, the weather, from what I hear, is 80 degrees, more like my hometown, Miami, than anything. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, it's been a cold winter, so we're excited to get outside, actually see the baseballs fly on the field instead of inside. <laughs>